YouTube. In this video, we'll be going over how to use the split screen multitasking feature on the Samsung Galaxy S24 Ultra. If you're like me and love to multitask on your phone, then hopefully this video will be very helpful for you. We're going to be talking about one of the most useful features for the phone, which is the split screen app feature. This feature, in a nutshell, lets you run two apps side by side, making it easier to juggle tasks. This will help boost productivity and just get things done faster. So whether you're replying to messages while watching a YouTube video, or checking your email while scrolling through social media, this feature will make your Galaxy phone feel like a mini productivity powerhouse. This should work on the S24 Ultra, S24 and S24 Plus as well. So if you wanna learn how to use split screen on your Galaxy device, stick around. I'm gonna walk you through step by step. Plus give you some features and some auxiliary features that come built in on your Galaxy device. So to get started, we'll go into what exactly split screen is. This feature is where you can actually split the screen real estate on your S24 Ultra and you can actually open two compatible apps at the same time. So you can use a section of the screen for one app and the other section of the screen for another app. The easiest way to kind of explain this is to actually just show you what it's like. So to get started, we have Google Chrome loaded up here with a website. And as you can see, normally Google Chrome will be loaded on the full screen. But let's say that you don't need to use Google Chrome for the entire screen and you actually want to do something else while keeping Chrome open so you can easily get back to it and reference it. This is fairly easy and I'll just show you what it looks like first. So here what we have is Google Chrome loaded up with Adobe, which will by default just split up between half the page. So, so as you can see, we are currently running two apps side by side to each other. And this will, by the way, work in portrait and or landscape mode as well. So if you were to rotate the phone, this will switch to landscape mode. So to get started and actually trying to open up an app in split screen mode, let's just go back to the full screen view for a second here. So what I have here is just Google Chrome loaded up. What you wanna to do to get started with split screen mode is to actually hit the multitasking button at the bottom left of your screen there. And as you can see, you'll open up to the last app, which is Adobe here in the background. You wanna move back to Google Chrome there and then from this multitasking screen, what you want to do is actually hit the Google Chrome icon and this little menu will pop up. This menu is how you activate multitasking view in any given app that it's compatible with. So let's say you have YouTube opened up. Once you hit the multitasking button, you would hit the YouTube icon and then you would get back to this menu. And then from here, the trick is you want to be able to open up in split screen view. So you want to hit open up in split screen view, and then you'll be taken to this menu. This menu will have the list of compatible apps that are available for split screen view. One thing you might want to know is that not all apps are compatible, but a lot of the commonly used ones are. So from here, we'll just open up Adobe again there, and we'll get back to the split screen view. And this is actually just as easy as it sounds in terms of opening up two apps in split screen view. There are some other features here that you may want to know about as well as you can actually resize the amount of space that a given app in split screen view takes up. So you'll see this three, three dots at the middle of the screen here. If you hold and drag up or down on those three dots, you'll see that the amount of real estate that a given app takes up for split screen will change. And you can actually change this to a pretty significant portion of the screen. This is very helpful if you, for, say, for, for example, want to keep another app like a music player opened up in the background, and you can use that as a quick control if you like, just by having it take up a little amount of space in the screen. One other feature that you might also want to know about is that you can actually open up two of the same app at the same time in split screen view in the case you needed to do so. So in this case, let's try opening up two versions of the Google Chrome app. So from here, we've hit the multitasking button. And of course we want to hit the Google Chrome icon and then you want to hit open up in split screen view. And as you can see, Google Chrome is available to open up in split screen view. So you can have two versions of Chrome running at the same time. 
And just to show you, we have two versions of Chrome running out at the same time. And these aren't separate tabs. These are just two full on different versions of Chrome running at the same time in split screen view. And there you have it everyone, just a really quick video on how to use split screen view and some of its features. If you like this kind of content or find this kind of content helpful, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.